Hello everyone and welcome to First Look into Ensemble Stars Music, an awesome gacha based rhythm game for iOS and Android. I am someone who doesn't really have much experience with rhythm games, but I've always had an interest in them. So when I got contacted about checking out the game for a video, I was very much on board with the idea. On that note, I'm pleased to announce that this video is indeed sponsored by Ensemble Stars Music. Now my aim with this video is to keep things basic and easy to understand because I am still a new player myself too, not just to the game, but the genre itself. So if you're someone like me that has had an interest in rhythm games but never really got around to playing one, then stick around as we'll cover the ropes and fun stuff together here. Now before we get to tapping notes, it's important to make sure you have a full squad of idols to perform the songs themselves. Over on the bottom right of the screen, we have the scout button, so uh, let's see what's inside. Some people probably guessed it, but yep, this is the gacha menu for the game. Here you will find all kinds of various banners to choose from. At any given point and the overall selection for the idols is pretty big so I'm sure everyone can find some for their liking. Now for the purposes of this video I was given resources for this account so I can feature stuff better. Having said that we can now proceed into seeing what the scouting itself looks like when you do it. So let's go ahead and choose the uh, Shinobu banner here and uh, we'll do a recruit of 10 with a guaranteed four star in the in the mix as well and uh, you'll see how it looks like. Let's go. All right here it comes. Tap the screen and uh, fun stuff happens. The show begins! We even have cool intros for all the idols. Oh, and there you go! Look who it is! The right up character himself. Wow. Five stars and everything. Looking awesome. And here come the rest as well. Very important to have a lot of idols in your squad. More cool intros. We got Natsuma as well, another 5-star character. Very, very awesome. And uh, there you go. It's as simple as that. So now we have some brand new idols to work with as well. Now by getting second or more copies, you also improve the idols even more. So even duplicates are obviously still a good thing. So that's how scouting new idols happens. Earning the currency to scout can be done in various ways, including the upcoming anniversary celebration for the game that will not only have cool new events happening, but also a lot of free gifts for everyone. So now is a perfect time to get familiar with the game. Now, after you've obtained your idols, uh, one important thing is to make them shine even more. To do that, I'm going to open the card menu from the right here. And here you can choose any one you like. I'm going to choose Hokuto over here. And when then when you tap on the uh, idle road button, it opens up their road to stardom, if you will. Think of this as your skill tree for the idols themselves. So by playing the game, you unlock items that you will use to make them perform even better on stage. For instance, like this, this in increases his dance stat. Very cool. And better yet, once you uh, fully max out their idol road, you get a uh, special uh, hot limit outfit as well for them. And again, as I have been given some bonus resources for demonstration purposes, let me show you how that looks like right here. I'm just going to tap the uh, unlock all button. And uh, here he goes. Boom. Look at that. Brand new look for Hokuto. Yes, indeed. So that's now a perfectly new outfit for me to uh, use on stage. Very cool. Also, make sure you keep leveling your idols too by giving them EXP tickets that you earn from playing too, like this. Simple as that. You also get EXP from just playing songs, but this is the main way you're going to level up your idols. Oh, and in case you're someone that is into the story of the game and want to read the stories of the past events as well, well, good news for you too. You can find all of that in the story menu for you to check out. If you click on the story campaign button right here and click on the event story, it has all the uh, previous stories of the uh, game just right here for you to read if you so choose to, to get even more familiar with all the uh, various talents we have in the game. And regarding the main story, it's a great way to get familiar with all the various idols and their groups, and they even have rehearsals that are basically uh, free repeatable stages that even give you free diamonds when you certain clear conditions are met later. It's another good way to earn some bonus currency for yourself. Now, let us hop onto some gameplay. Tap on the live stage button right here and then hit live. And uh, now we're greeted with a very big cast of songs. So I would not worry about, you know, any of the sound getting repetitive because there's a lot of songs to go through. As a rhythm game rookie, I'm glad to report also that there are difficulty options, as you can see on the right, available for all skill levels. I've mostly stuck to the normal difficulty myself for now, but I've also dipped my toes into the hard stuff. But for now, let's do a simple normal song to show you 
how the songs play out. And also here you can see uh, I am rocking the uh, brand new uniform or hook to as well that I just unlocked. Very cool. And uh, we are good to go here. Let's go. So now notes, notes start rolling in here as the concert begins and uh, you simply tap them. The blue ones are simple taps and the orange ones require you to hold the note a little bit. And the better your timing is on hitting the notes, uh, the more points you will get, basically. As you can see. Also, one thing to note is that the performances on the background themselves are absolutely stunning looking. Now, some of the notes you, you see will have arrows to them. Those you're basically supposed to uh, flick on the direction they point towards. So, you know, it gets a bit more technical than that. And yeah, the performances themselves are just a sight to behold. <laughs> but of, of course, you could always adjust the video if you want to. If you're really, like, gonna be tryharding this game and you want to go for the high scores and perfect clears and whatnot, you know, you're free to do whatever you want. But I kind of enjoy the performances on the background. Now, as you can see, I'm definitely not great at the game still. I am, after all, learning the ropes. But it's, it's somehow very addicting. I would recommend everyone for trying this out for themselves. You could probably spend hours and hours with this game every single day if you wanted to. But it's also a nice game for casual plays too. If you're ever like, you know, on a small break or anything and you have some time to kill, why not jam out a song or two, you know? It's a great way to pass the time too. Also, the game also has multiplayer for those wondering, so you can even play with your friends. But there you go. I sadly suck so much, I didn't even clear the song. So yeah, as you can see, I have a lot to learn. <laughs> but hey, I'm having fun and that's all that matters. Now, if the gameplay happens to feel either too slow or too fast, then have no fear. If you tap the menu button, top right, and then on the live settings button at the bottom, all of this stuff can be adjusted, including calibrating your notes to the speeds and even customizing the uh, look of the uh, notes themselves. So there's a lot to do here if you if you're feeling like customizing your gameplay experience from the default now before i show you the hard difficulty which is probably gonna kick my ass let me show you another cool thing the game has that is the office right here at the bottom right so what the office is it's a custom space that you can customize from the ground up yourself for you and your idols to hang out in this is an example office that doesn't have a lot going on for it yet but you can already get the idea the idols themselves move around and uh, interact with all the objects you have put in which is awesome, and you can also interact with the uh, idols themselves. Very cool stuff. And you also get rewards while doing so. But you can also have uh, more layouts if you really want to get creative here. So here's an example layout of a uh, more established place. And you can already kind of see that. They're all the fun stuff that you can really, you know, do with your layouts. You're basically only limited by your... Uh, imagination here you can just do whatever you want with your office which is cool and there you go you can also disable the ui to get a better look at your idols you can zoom and look admire all the details like they're having a good time all right let me show you real briefly what harder difficulties look like again warning i am not a great rhythm game player yet but i'm hoping this game can help me with that but just for those wondering if you if you're a seasoned rhythm gamer yes it can get hard like i'm only gonna show you a real brief example here let's choose a different song as well why not and uh, i'm gonna hit the expert mode i'm only gonna show you a little bit of it because you know there's no real point in me playing the full song right now but this should give you an idea of how crazy this can get as well so which is it's, it's really one thing i like that you know no matter what your skill level is this game has you covered now now we only have we have more basically notes <laughs> to press on as well here like you can see this is just wait for it it, it gets a bit crazy <laughs> i'm surprisingly hitting some of them which is yeah this is um yeah you get the idea right it's uh definitely a challenge if you so choose to 
do the songs in. And finally, if you're someone that just wants to enjoy the stunning performances of the idols, you can just tap on the MV difficulty button, which will let you just admire the performance with full English subtitles and with the cast of your choosing, including their costumes. This is an awesome little feature. So there you have it, a fast look into Ensemble Stars music. If you're on the lookout for a great rhythm game experience for your mobile devices, this is a great time to hop on just as the anniversary rolls around the corner. Check out all the links below and get the game now. If you enjoyed this video, I'd appreciate it if you press the like button and maybe consider subscribing to my channel. Thank you again Ensemble Stars Music for sponsoring this video and I hope to see you guys again in the next video. Peace out!